So when everybody's got one, I'll tell you what I know and how I got involved with it. So if you haven't met me, I've been here a couple of times getting, seeing if people wanted to march on Bank of America. So we did that. And when it was over, one of the people in the coffee party that was the way you want. So the, this part of the process is to get you thinking about the change you want to make happen. What I gather about this group is that they want to bring the other groups together to get more power to deal with human rights issues in this area. So I decided to kind of ride it out with them and help them with some groups. They're going to have a convention on the 1st of September, probably in the old Safeway, the pink building between 11th and 12th on the interstate, on the east side of the interstate. Um, I don't know how it's going to play out. I'm just kind of checking it out. But I thought I'd try to roll it along a little bit to see if it becomes something good. So... Just say, I just want to say, basically, my state of life, like I said, it's called the people petition. Yeah. It's pretty much very similar to what you do. Very, very similar. So, well, and so, you know, I think their ideas are good, and I think there is a... Uh, I'll finish the sentence and ask you a question. Uh, I, I think there is an underlying aspect of human rights in all these progressive movements. So it kind of makes sense to me, and that's about where I am right now. Who are these people? The Immigrants' Rights right Coalition are the people that are driving it. All about it. Um, they've been involved. They've won, run another convention right. in El Paso. That really seemed to be driven by some border rights group. Uh, if you get a whole bunch of people together and make something happen, that border rights group had a lot of members, and they really pulled that thing off. They had about 500 people. Um, what they're looking for is some resolutions about what people would like to see happen in the community. It's done community, well, major urban area by major urban area. They want to hit San Antonio, uh, Austin, Dallas, Fort Worth, Houston, and maybe one way in the South Dallas. Part of it in the First of September. It'll be the middle part of the day at the Saturday, um, and it'll be over at Mesitas or Mejitas, or however you want to say it over there at between 11th and 12th on the east side of the interstate. It's where they had Camp Obama if you were hanging around back then. Same place. So, now what happens to this? You do this, I'll compile your results and come up with sort of what I, I see as the sense of the group on each of these questions. I'll report back to you and say what I found. And if you, you think, well, okay, you kind of got it right, then I'll take this forward to the other group. If you think, you know, you don't have it right, we're really not interested, then we'll just tear it up and throw it away right here. So that's our process. I can do it and be back next Monday. Wait, better think, Ken. I think I can be back here next Monday if that's a good day for y'all. Can we fill these out and bring them back then? That's, this that's the question I was going to have. Because these answers take well, let's, let's, let's do yeah. this. If you think that you really want to put your heart into this, rather than get a bunch of quick crap, I'd rather see you take it home, talk to people, get some feeling on it, and I'll come back Monday and pick them up. I mean, that's fine. Yeah. A meaningful response is yeah. better than, oh yeah, we did it, check the box. I think yeah. that's going to be a better uh, I appreciate, appreciate the suggestion. And also, maybe you can yeah. give us your address. I can just send it to you in the mail. <laughs> yeah, you get more than I, th I think you're right, and, and sharing and talking about it is only good. <laughs> so, thank you. So, I'm going to put my... I, got, I, I need one of those. Oh. Yeah, I'm going to give you this one. Oh, no. Okay. Uh, or we could just leave. No, I'll pick them up. Uh, voluntary <laughs> <laughs> cool, you only have to do it if you want to. Yeah, this is better than school. <laughs> Way better than school. Yeah, and you I'll get to say what you think and there's no grading. No oh, grades. No grading. You say that and I'm going to get back and it's going to be like a 90 on there. <laughs> <laughs> no grading. This is where the teacher, no grading. the teacher has to face the class and he's got no principal behind him. So, you know, no, no D-Hall, no nothing. So.